Did you know that honey is often called nature's liquid gold? Every year, American beekeepers harvest nearly 139 million pounds of honey, an amount so immense it could coat billions of pancakes with a golden layer of sweetness. So how are these shimmering golden drops created? The secret lies not only in the tireless work of millions of bees, but also in the dedication of skilled beekeepers and in the meticulous process of harvesting, refining, and transporting that preserves honey's pure natural flavor. In this documentary, we'll explore the remarkable journey of honey, from vibrant flower fields buzzing with life to the golden drop that graces your breakfast table. Honeybees are nature's tiny warriors, delicate in appearance, yet unmatched in their endurance. With wings that beat hundreds of times per second, they can fly at speeds exceeding 15 miles per hour and visit up to 2,000 flowers each day, tirelessly creating every golden drop of honey. The United States stands among the world's leading honey producers, generating nearly $175 million in annual revenue from this industry. Yet the true worth of honey lies far beyond its pure sweetness. It's the result of a remarkably meticulous process. Millions of bees gathering nectar from vast meadows while beekeepers carefully maintain the ideal environment to preserve its purity and flawless quality. But honey is only part of their contribution. Bees play an essential role in American agriculture, adding an estimated $15 billion each year through pollination, a vital link that sustains the nation's entire food system. As the gentle spring winds sweep across South Dakota, beekeepers begin their meticulous preparations for the upcoming honey season. Every colony is carefully inspected, from the overall health of the bees and the strength of the worker population to the condition of the queen, the very heart of the hive. To ensure a productive harvest, each detail must be managed with precision. Beekeepers replace or repair old frames and add new ones when necessary, giving the colony enough space to store the growing supply of nectar. It's a delicate balance between care, timing, and observation, the foundation for a successful honey harvest. After six to eight weeks of careful tending, the honeycombs begin to show a thin layer of white wax, a clear sign that the honey has fully ripened and is ready for harvest. At this stage, the moisture level has dropped to the point where the honey can be stored for long periods without fermenting. Beekeepers meticulously inspect each frame, selecting only those where the cells are completely sealed with wax and filled with mature honey. This delicate process marks one of the most rewarding moments of beekeeping, when nature's work and human patience finally converge in perfect harmony, ready to yield the season's golden harvest. Once all preparations are complete, beekeepers begin the harvest, a task that demands precision, patience, and an exceptionally gentle touch. They start by creating thin streams of smoke using natural materials such as dry wood, tree bark, or sawdust. The light smoke is carefully wafted around the hive, encouraging the bees to retreat deeper inside. This technique not only calms the colony, but also masks the alarm pheromones that bees release, allowing the harvest to proceed smoothly without disrupting the hive's delicate structure. The honey-filled frames, glistening with a warm golden hue, are then carefully removed one by one. Beekeepers must handle each frame with great care to avoid cracking the wax or damaging the comb, as these structures will be reused by the colony in the next season. Before moving the frames, they gently brush away the bees using soft bristles or specialized tools, ensuring no harm comes to them in the process. Alongside harvesting comes the principle of preservation. Beekeepers always leave behind a sufficient amount of honey to sustain the colony through the cold winter months. This balance between taking and giving back ensures the bees remain strong and healthy, ready to resume their work when spring returns. Finally, the fragrant, honey-laden frames are neatly placed into specialized storage boxes, sealed carefully for transport to the processing facility. There, the journey continues. From the open fields and wooden hives to the skilled hands of the beekeeper until it becomes the pure golden liquid that sweetens breakfast tables across the nation. After leaving the bee farms, 
the Honey's journey continues through an impressive network of modern logistics. Instead of relying solely on trucks, large quantities of honey are transported by specialized aircraft, ensuring that every drop reaches the processing facility as fresh as the moment it left the hive. From above, tons of honey cross over mountain ranges, vast plains and wide rivers, heading straight to the Manuka factory, where time and temperature are critical. The rapid transport prevents exposure to fluctuating weather conditions, preserving the honey's natural purity, aroma, and enzyme-rich quality. This seamless combination of nature's craftsmanship and human innovation ensures that when the honey finally arrives for processing, it remains as vibrant and wholesome as it was in the hive. Every golden drop still carries the untouched essence of the wild, a taste of nature's sweetness, carefully protected from the moment it was made. When the honey containers arrive at the processing plant, the production line begins with a series of carefully controlled steps. The first stage takes place inside a specialized storage area known as the warming room, where the temperature is kept steady between 98 and 104 degrees Fahrenheit. This precisely maintained heat gently warms the honey, reducing its viscosity so that it flows more easily during the extraction and filtration phases that follow. More importantly, the process is designed to preserve the natural enzymes, vitamins, and aroma of raw honey without exposing it to excessive heat. Throughout the warming phase, an automated monitoring system tracks even the smallest variations in temperature and timing, ensuring that the honey remains in ideal condition. This marks a subtle yet crucial beginning to the entire production chain, where advanced technology and respect for nature work hand in hand, allowing every drop that leaves the factory to retain the pure, unspoiled flavor crafted by the bees themselves. After being gently warmed in the storage room, the honeycombs move on to a stainless steel conveyor belt, beginning the next phase of their transformation inside the uncapping machine, an elegant piece of engineering designed to remove the natural wax layer that bees build to seal and protect their honey. Each frame passes through the system with mechanical precision, where every movement is synchronized to ensure the honey remains untouched while the protective wax cap is carefully lifted away. This thin coating, only fractions of an inch thick, once served as nature's barrier, guarding the honey from air and moisture. Inside the machine, high-speed rotating blades or heated knives glide evenly across the surface of each frame. Their motion is gentle, yet incredibly precise, slicing through the wax at exact angles without disturbing the delicate hexagonal structure of the comb beneath. The process combines precision mechanics and soft handling, allowing the honey to flow freely in later stages while keeping the frame fully reusable. By preserving these frames, beekeepers reduce material waste and maintain a sustainable cycle for future harvests, a harmony between efficiency and respect for nature's craftsmanship. The wax removed during this stage doesn't go to waste. Every ounce collected is melted down, filtered, and recycled into new forms. Candles, natural balms, cosmetics, or new foundation sheets used in beehives. What was once a protective seal for honey now begins a second life serving human use. This closed loop process perfectly reflects the philosophy of modern honey production, where nothing in nature is wasted and every element continues its purpose in another form, preserving the beauty, balance, and sustainability of the beekeeping world. Once the wax layer has been completely removed, the honeycombs embark on the next chapter of their transformation, entering the centrifugal extractor, a sophisticated machine engineered to use centrifugal force to separate the honey from the comb cells with minimal disturbance to the structure. As each frame is carefully secured inside the stainless steel drum of the extractor, the device begins to spin at extraordinary speeds generating forces that fling the golden nectar outward. The honey flows down the drum walls and collects at the base, while the comb remains intact, ready to be returned to the hive for reuse. This powerful yet precise operation ensures that the extraction process is not only swift and efficient, but also dramatically reduces waste of raw material. What distinguishes this method is its entirely mechanical nature. No heat, no chemicals are applied. The absence of excessive heat means that the honey's natural color remains vibrant, 
Its aroma stays rich and the delicate enzymes and nutrients, so essential to its health beneficial properties, are preserved. Meanwhile, the comb frames themselves are spared damage, allowing beekeepers to reuse them for several harvests. This reuse dramatically cuts down on raw material costs and fosters an environmentally conscious production cycle. Following the spin, the nectar still carries with it fine traces of wax particles and minuscule dust. To achieve the highest level of clarity and purity, the honey is immediately routed to a coarse filtration system. There, it passes through stainless steel macro layers or ultra-fine mesh filters that trap the remaining solid impurities. Once filtration is complete, the honey emerges from the system clean, translucent, and deceptively smooth on the surface, ready to proceed to further refining, packaging, and ultimately to the breakfast table. After filtration, the honey is transferred into large stainless steel tanks, where it's gently stirred to unify flavor and color. The temperature is kept around 95 to 104 degrees Fahrenheit, preventing crystallization and ensuring a smooth texture. This step also removes tiny air bubbles, giving the honey a clear, glossy look. It's the final refinement before packaging, transforming raw nature into a stable, consistent, and ready-to-serve product. Before the packaging stage begins, every batch of honey must pass through a comprehensive quality control process designed to guarantee both safety and authenticity. In the inspection room, trained technicians conduct a series of tests that evaluate the honey's clarity, viscosity, color, aroma, and purity. Each sample is examined under precise lighting to detect even the smallest variations in hue or transparency while viscosity meters measure its smooth flow, a key indicator of freshness and proper moisture balance. Representative samples are then taken to a specialized laboratory where scientists analyze the honey's natural sugar composition, moisture content, pH levels, and trace impurities. These tests ensure that every drop maintains the right balance between glucose and fructose, keeping it stable without crystallizing or fermenting. The moisture level typically maintained between 15 and 18 percent, plays a critical role in preserving the honey's long shelf life. Any deviation beyond this range could compromise its purity, texture, and aroma. Beyond chemical analysis, sensory experts also evaluate the aroma and taste profile, confirming that the honey retains its distinct floral notes and natural sweetness. The goal is not only to verify quality, but also to preserve the character that reflects its origin the flowers, climate, and environment that gave it life. Only after meeting all established standards is the honey approved for packaging. This careful process ensures that each jar reaching consumers embodies both nature's craftsmanship and human precision. Every golden drop tells a story of bees, blossoms, and dedication, arriving on the table exactly as it was in the hive, pure, vibrant, and alive with the essence of nature. In the final stage, the journey of honey reaches the automated packaging line, where precision engineering ensures every bottle reflects both efficiency and care. The golden liquid flows through stainless steel pipes into automatic filling machines, where advanced sensors measure each portion with absolute accuracy. Every drop is accounted for. Not a single ounce is wasted. Within just one hour, the system can fill nearly 6,000 bottles, maintaining perfect uniformity across every unit. Once filled, the bottles glide seamlessly along the conveyor to the automatic capping station, where caps are sealed tightly to prevent air or contaminants from entering. The sealing process not only preserves the natural enzymes, color, and aroma of the honey, but also extends its freshness for months or even years. From there, Bottles move on to the labeling unit, where high-speed printers apply labels with precise alignment, providing essential information such as origin, ingredients, and expiration date. At the end of the line, workers conduct a final inspection, ensuring that each bottle meets visual and weight standards before it's carefully packed into reinforced cardboard boxes. Every package is then sealed and prepared for global distribution, from local stores to international markets. This stage represents more than just packaging. It embodies the culmination of the entire process, a perfect blend of craftsmanship and technology. 
Each bottle that leaves the facility carries not only the pure sweetness of nature, but also the dedication of those who preserve it. Through automation and precision, Honey's natural integrity remains untouched, allowing consumers everywhere to experience it just as the bees made it, pure, golden, and alive. From the flower fields to the factory floor, Honey's journey is one of nature, precision, and devotion. Each drop carries sunlight, the rhythm of the seasons, and the tireless work of millions of bees. Even with modern automation, spinning, filtering, bottling, its essence remains unchanged, pure, golden, and alive. Behind every bottle lies a harmony of nature and human craftsmanship, connecting ancient tradition with today's innovation. If you believe in preserving this natural wonder, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share so more people can discover the incredible journey of honey from the hive to your table.